Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608 and today I am playing Star Maid and we are going to continue to work on this cargo container. Alright, what does a cargo container need to contain cargo? Well, it has sides, it doesn't really need sides, but it needs, well, cargo spaces. We're going to hook that up and no, we're not. We're not going to do that yet. We are going to add some features that you don't find on most, most, um, cargo containers, but I like to put on mine. Alright. I like to put a th put thrusters on my cargo containers, or in my cargo containers. Why do you put thrusters in your cargo containers? Well, if you're moving them around the yard, it's easier if you have the container itself as a ship, I think. So I like to put at least a little thrust on them. That's probably overkill. And a little power. Let's see. And... As a bonus, you can uh, use this power for as um, as uh, extra power to the ship. No, you can't. You can use the thrust as extra power to the ship. That's a lot of power. I guess you could. Uh, uh, that's way too much power for what we're doing. We're gonna just take that out. You just need enough to to. Uh, Power those thrusters. We'll power 60,000. Yeah, that's more than enough for these thrusters. Actually, thrust uh, power consumed per second is 2,000. Uh, 25, so we don't want too much. Let's see. Power consumed per second is 1,000, so we want to keep it a little above 1,000. That's probably sufficient. That's what one behind there, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight power reactors and the capacitors there just in case. Why are there thrusters? As I said, to move it around a shipyard easier without having beams and and grabby things and tugboats and all that. Uh, and if you're in a vessel like this, or a mining vessel, and something bad happens, you're crippled, you have some extra thrusters power stuff sitting around in your cargo container. If all else fails, this is a uh, escape pod now. Okay, what else do we need? We need some cargo spaces. See, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Tall, five, six. Actually, those can go to seven, but we want to do that 14 there. And this needs to go to 7 with 14 on the top. And we'll just do the same there. So this whole thing, except for right under here, is filled entirely with cargo, except that is now filled with cargo as well. Cargo spaces. Alright. Okay, it's hard to navigate in those. So all this is now cargo space, even in between the the, uh, the thrusters and reactors and all that jazz. How much cargo space, you ask? Servers under heavy load. Alright, how much cargo space? Let's see, 66,000 volume units. That is a lot. Let's see, for example, if you're using this for a mining ship, uh, a single Theron's ore is a mass of 0 0.01. So you can hold a whole bunch of uh, ores. Crystals looks like all the... actually I've never literally looked. Uh, all the shards are the same mass. You can tell down here. But if you can't see it, click show block information. And it gives you well block information. Uh, ores, the same mass as crystals. Capsules are the same. And detonators are a little heavier. See, what's a hull? A standard standard gray hull is 0 0.05. Uh, do I have anything that is a 1? Huh. Doesn't look like it. You could probably, you could easily fit all the stuff that that uh, builds up a cargo container into a cargo container. Probably hold the whole fleet of cargo containers in a cargo container. Anyway, let's see. I want to spruce mine up, so I'm going to get some white standard armor. You can use hull or whatever. I think in my, my single player we used hull. 
because it was uh, cheap. Let's see. Let's, that should be 15. 1, 2, 3, 4. Skip 1, 2, 3, 4. Skip 1, 2, 3, 4. 2, 3, 1, 2, 4. Except I don't want symmetry on this. 2, 3, 4. Skip 1, 2, 3, 4. Da, 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 da. I probably should have kept the grid out. There we go. And I'm going to brand mine. You can make whatever design or no design or whatever you want. It is your cargo container. You can draw whatever the skills you, level you have of of uh artistry and star made if you can fit it on a container you can put it on there let's see i just like 608 on here it is my favorite number in fact uh jw608 just an interesting bit of trivia the 608 does have significance i am not just the the uh there wasn't 607 608s or jw's before me 608 was actually my nickname in college Yes, I even wrote 608 on a, a as exam a teacher passed out, uh, semester final. I wrote my name down as 608, and he didn't even notice. Anyway, uh, it, was a, it was a joke of sorts. Anyway, long story, probably didn't care. I can't really say I blame you. I don't like that. Actually, I kind of like... Kind of like that better. Okay, 608. And probably should put something on this side. Um, can I do a little 608? 6. Oh. 8. Ooh, that probably would have worked out better and yeah I like this one I think I like this one better than the other side so after we leave each other I might go repair the other side let's see and if you want you can put lights or whatever on it Actually, I think that turned out to be about the same. It was about the same. Except I had, like, that. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, that I did the exact same thing and said I like one side better. But, actually, I do like that better. Okay. I didn't do that in symmetry because this would have been 806. Well, 80 backwards 6. Nobody wants that. Okay. That's the front. We got our door. I don't really need the door, but I like having it just in case. Um, well, uh, transparency, the, the cargo stuff doesn't work with transparency properly. Let me show you. Let me grab you some white crystal armor. That's a transparent block. And you see the little weird greenish streak texture thing I got going. I'm not real sure why my game chooses to view it like that. It works. No, oh, they're slabs. Duh. Stop that. I want not slapped. See, you can't see them now that there's a transparent block. So you can see it, not see it. And it's not just when the, um, the cargo's empty because you aren't going to see that at all once I get out of build mode but um, even when the uh, cargo spaces are full you won't be able to see them through uh, through uh, transparent blocks so I like having a door so if you're just roaming around you can open the door and say oh this one's empty we'll take this one or oh this one's half full we need to unload it or oh this one you know, well, you get that you, know, you can also check from from this block 
Now the idea is having this block, um, or these blocks, actually uh, visible from the inside. I think I deleted a little cargo space, but we'll live. So when you're, you're docked to something, you can actually walk up and turn this on and check the cargo while you're without getting out of the ship or doing all types of weird things. You can use the um, uh, hold up, my brain stopped. Uh, docking, docking. It's not docking. Um, I'll be with you in just one moment. You can use uh, up and down when you're when you're in a in a docked vessel or a vessel with something docked to it. You can press up and down to cycle through the uh, various and sundry parent child docks. No, no, no! I don't like that. I want. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Getting carried. You can up and down to jump from ships that are that are docked. I'm trying to talk and and do this at the same time, and it apparently is not working. Put that there. Come on, spin the right direction, right there. There we go. So now if I'm docked to something, a ship or whatever, I have uh, access from within whatever ship I am to using the, uh, the controls for my cargo container. And I just kind of like the stripedy stuff. And I brought these out instead of using these for slabs in case I just want to have a small opening on the ship to access the cargo container. So this would come directly in contact with the ship and I want to have these weird gaps. That's the, that's the logic behind this, or the thinking behind the, uh, the full blocks beside the slabs. Alright, so we are now going to save. This is going to be a 608 underscore. Um, I'm going to use 608 underscore for 608 stuff. Okay. Uh, 608 underscore cargo con 60. Actually, cancel that. Did I actually delete enough to change? No, it's 66k. Okay. So save. I'm going to call it 608 cargo con 66k. So I know this is the 66k version if I have built a little container like I did initially in the, the single player. Uh, I can call it the uh, what 12k or whatever. So when I'm looking for cargo containers, I need a cargo container, but I need one that'll hold 100k. I know this one isn't 100k. All right, and it'll also give me the flexibility to build multiple cargo containers and not get confused. Anyway, you get the drill. All right, so that's a nice little cargo container. Probably nicer than, than it should be, but hey. All right, I've been JW608. This has been StarMade. And next time we will we'll look at a, a system, look at starting a system to handle these things. And I will see you then. I have to think about how I'm going to set this up. Hmm. Anywho, I'll dig you cats later.